Hi friends, I'm Parways and this is our third video in Python GUI development with PySite 6. Now in this video we're going to learn that how you can uh, build buttons using PySite. Now for creating of buttons we can use a Q push button class. Now Q push button class is related to Qt widgets module. Now first of all I have already created a new Python file. Uh, what I want to do is to copy some codes from here and I want to just grab my window code because I have already showed that how you can create simple window and we don't need this uh, Q label uh, also we can just copy this class window that extends from a Q widget class and we can change this to Q push button uh, also, we are going to just copy uh, these line of codes from here and I can just add this in here and I can just make this for example sys.argv. Now if I run this, uh, we don't need this uh, for right now, we don't need this Q font and also Q pex map and if I run this you'll see that I have a simple window in here. Now as I've already said for creating of the button we need to use Q push button and the Q push button is uh, related to Qt widgets module so we can just say Q push button first we need to import that and after that in here we need to create the object of our Q push button so I can just say btn Q push button and first you need to give the text of the button for example click and after that you need to give the parent so that's self I'll not select but it is self uh, now if I run this you can see that I have a simple click button in here uh, also you can uh, if you see in here I have set text in here but also you can use uh, in another way so we can just say btn dot set text and I can just say click me and if I run this you can see now we have our click mean here uh, there is a method of set geometry that you can use uh, for Q push button and you can give the X and Y position and also uh, width and height of the push button so in here we can just say btn.set geometry for example the X position is 100 the Y position is 100 uh, the width is 130 and the height is 130 and now you can see that we have a bigger button in here in the XY position. Uh, also you can set an icon uh, for your push button. So we can just say btn dot set icon and for this we need to use Q icon and I have an icon folder and also I have qt.png. So now you can see that we have icon in here. Also you can change the font size of the push button. Uh, we can just say btn dot set font. Now set font expects Q font. For that we need to import Q font and that's related to uh, Qt uh, GUI module. So we can just say Q font class. And in here now we can say Q font and you need to give the type of the font or the family of the font and also you need to give the size of the font for example like this and if I run this and now you can see that we have a bigger font also you can change the icon size uh, we can just say btn dot set icon size it expects Q icon or not Q icon but it uh, expects Q size class and that's related to Qt core and I can just say from dot Qt core we are going to import Q size and let's add Q size in here Q size uh, first I need to so I can give the width and height of the icon so for example like this and now if I run this you can see that we have this button in here. Uh, also you can set the uh, 
style sheet or we can say set the background color and we can just say btn dot set style sheet and I can just say background color and I want it should be red color so now if I run this you can see that now I have a red color button in here uh, thank you guys so this was creating of the push button if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos please subscribe my channel like and share the video